Leo. After the gray soon, so the year is great quick. This is for your sun, moon, rising, and Venus for May to June of this current year. If y'all are doing quite well. If you want a personal reading, my email is down below. I don't charge, but I do take tips and donations, and my PayPal is also in the description if you so choose. Hope you enjoy this video, and I hope this helps you out in any way. Let us begin. It's, got, it's going to be a six ways to sideways. That's what I call it. Uh, epiphany. Truth right here. We got your card right here. Strength. That's what you're wanting and wishing. Having the strength. Oh, King of Cups, your fears and rejections. Could be Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces right there. Then we have the Ten of Swords as a situation. Ooh. We also have Two of Pentacles reversed and the obstacles and challenges, not only knowing what options to take. Prince of Cups is the catalyst as well as the final result, not giving out love, possibly for mature reasons. Possibly. The end beginning theme. Your card. King of Wands. Once again, you are trying to be in your element to get stuff started, to get things charged up. <clears throat> the trial situation, though, is interesting. Hmm. What that's about. Like, you're keeping your strength up, not offering your heart, but... This truth here has you confused about what to do. Aware of what must be done to get you centered back with your emotions again. Oh, two aces, and this is confusing. Actually, not really. Um, Ace of Pentacles with the Ace of Swords. It could mean that this offer is powerful, or it could also mean someone's delusional about like that the power will consume them, too. Damn, Leo. Okay, Ten of Swords. Betrayal. Even witnesses to the betrayal. Someone in the background watching it happen. Um, someone trying to blast swords while the other person gets stabbed with them. Like setting somebody up. Knight of Cups, once again. Not giving your cup up. <clears throat> or them not offering you their cup in the past. Once again, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. I feel like they're turning away with their cup. Then we got your card, Strength, right here. Wanting to restrict yourself or hold out when it comes to not communicating, but it might be through arrogance you're doing this. You might be a little bit arrogant with it. You might be thinking that you're just... You might just think that you're God. Just a tad. You might have that going for you. Or whatever com communication does pour in, it's not good. It stems off of not a very good nature. <clears throat> Two of Pentacles reverse, not really knowing what to do. That's your... Obstacle and challenge, what you have to go against in this, right? Or whoever this person has to go against. It doesn't necessarily have to be you. It could be cross watchers too. Queen of Pentacles reverse, someone who might be a little bit selfish, a little bit demanding. It could be Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Whew. Sorry, I've been a little weird as of late. Um, she is. She shows off more than she does create, I think. And there's a lot of like not knowing what to do about her too. But this Knight of Cups does. Both Knight of Cups actually, Knight of Cups, Prince of Cups, both have their backs toward turn towards her in the past and the future. So she's someone who's very motherly, but she's very demanding as well. 
could be an unfaithful spouse too. Um, however, your fears and rejections is that like this King of Cups is connected to solar plexus with the um, his cup down here, letting it flourish and glow, grow. But it's like there's no action to take in order to get that started. Like something's not taking off, something's not happening. They have this Knight of Cups, which is the catalyst as well as the final result. It's like the treacherous behavior is the Ten of Swords. It's not offering a cup up at this. Um, really not go knowing a way to fix this so that's why you have your back turned to it like after this treachery happened you just kind of someone almost ignored it and since they've ignored it they're going to keep ignoring it because they don't know how to fix it nine of pentacles you want to get back to yourself so you can get back into power Trying to get your vibrations going to build them up to be better. Trying to invest financially to get yourself suited in that glamorous fashion y'all love to do. That fabulous style. Let's see. Yeah. Happiness, family, for good fortune, stuff like that. Things dreams are made of, dream come true. You got that all right here, but there's that treachery in the background. Trying to make everything look happy, honky-dory, but it's like... Trying to get a tree to develop more fruit than what it's naturally supposed to. It'll work for a while, but... For how long? Who knows? Ooh. And... Someone might have been involved in some risky business. Hmm. I feel like someone is, uh... I feel like with the tree, it's something that is... I feel like with the Queen of Pentacles, she just doesn't feel satisfied and you don't know how to satisfy her. You're trying to get money out of nothing, almost. Like, you're holding your strength up, but you're not trying to talk about how you feel about this a little bit, I think. You just want to keep this happy home, and it's just kind of like, hmm. Like, you're, like, I feel like you're somewhat worried about this Ace of Swords with the Ace of Pentacles. Because it's like, yeah, this is a great opportunity, but will this become, like, another fantasy and end up being... A liability of sorts, right? But this ten of swords down here kind of bothers me. It's like... Why is not offering your love or some sort of acknowledgement, like... Treacherous. Almost like bad karma. And the universe witnessed it. And then there's this risky behavior with all of this stuff. Like, I'm not sure. You could definitely be dealing with the water sign, but you, you ha you're gonna, it seems like you're gonna have a really hard time trying to work on whatever with this Queen of Pentacles. And that's why you have your backs turned to her, or this water sign has its back turned to them? I don't know. It's a very weird scenario. It's almost like the person's too immature to actually offer anything to the Queen of Pentacles. So it's like... Mm. But that's yours, Leo. I hope this video helps you out and thank you very much for watching. I will see you guys later and you take it easy. Bye-bye.